this nightmare? It's our annual club fair! There's hit the cans, the sack race, the hook a duck stand, the lemonade stand, clairvoyance, hey, that's new, the claw machine, <laughs> the face painting stand, and. Dunk a clown! Step right up, step right up, come try your luck. I know a clown who needs a good dunk. I've already won all the other games. The ping pong contest, whack-a-mole, skittles, but I've never won it. Dunk a clown. How hard can it be? To dunk the clown, you have to hit the target with the ball. But the ball is tiny, and the target is really far away. Come on, Steven, you can do it. Winning is just losing with a smile. Oh. That darn clown! Anyway, where do we start? I like to warm up with a few rounds at Hit the Cans. Erico? You want to <laughs> see the fortune teller? Nah, me superstitious. Come on, I don't believe in that stuff. <laughs> okay, Erico. See you at Hit the Cans. I'm not some chump! Everyone knows fortune telling's for chumps! Chumps! Hello? Come closer, my child. Closer. Welcome to the cave of mystery and magic. Have no fear. Take a seat. Hey, you're the guy who turned me into a ball. Hey, what do you know? Small world, isn't it? So, you want to know your future, huh? I just want to know if Daniel will be a champion. Will I get my body back one day or not? Palm reading, tarot cards, astrology, numerology. Crystal ball. Oh, I see you're a man of culture. Yeah. Just a minute. <laughs> Daniel Sisu, winning this World Cup has officially made you the greatest footballer in history. When did you realize you had it in you to become a champ, huh? Don't laugh, but I think it was the day I won at Dunk a Clown at my football's club annual fair. <laughs> With this new record, you've even dethroned Erico Platana. Any thoughts? <gasps> what? Did you get a good look? I can never see. Daniel's gonna be better than me? Daniel? It can't be. No one outdoes Erico Platana. The future isn't set in stone, you know. If you act now, you can still change its course. Yes! To think that one day he'll betray me. After everything I've done for him, he'll stab me in the back with his pudgy little hands. Look what I won, Erico! Huh? What did you win, you dirty little rat? A giant daddy! Oh, how adorable! You'll get what's coming to you, you snake in the grass. I won at the sack race, hit the cans, and the pancake stand. Everyone wins there. Oh, that is so awesome. You ready to go then? We had fun. You won your stuffed animals. We're good to go, right? No, Erico. I have to win at Dunker Clown. It's my destiny. I can feel it. Wait, don't you want to play something else? Another round of hit the cans, uh, hook the duck? No. Yoo-hoo, Daniel. I can do it, Erico. I feel it in my bones. This time is it. No, wait! I mean, uh, come on, champ, you can do it. It doesn't matter how you hold the ball. Huh? Am I holding the ball wrong? Yeah, forget what I said. The main thing is to not crumble under pressure, even if all your friends are watching you. Watching you. I don't know, Erico. I think I'm starting to feel like I might crumble. Oh, it's no big deal, Daniel. Just don't focus on maybe missing the target. Forget all about the pounding in your chest. Your sweaty palms. 
shallow breathing, or how the target seems to be shrinking. And most of all, never, ever, ever. I quit. <laughs> oh, what a shame. You were off to such a good start. You know the best part about not trying? Not losing. Nothing wrong with knowing your place. You chose wisely, Daniel. Lame. Well, you have fun. Let me know if you get a bite. Hey, there you go. Who's the champ now? You know, Eriko, you really have to go in little circles because otherwise you leave marks. If you say so. Yeah! <laughs> if Daniel doesn't become a champion, I'll be a ball forever. The future isn't set in stone, you know. If you act now, you can... Yeah, 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 I know, I got it. Hey, cut that out right now. It's because I burst the paddling pool. I failed at that, too. Listen up, kiddo. You're a champ, and champs don't mop floors. Is that why you never do chores? Don't change the subject. You gotta fight, Daniel. You gotta take risks. I want my body back. But you're the one who told me I should know my place. And that if you never try, you never fail. I said that? Yep. And not to give myself false hope. And that if I didn't dream too big, I wouldn't be disappointed, and... You gotta become a champ, okay? A champ! A champ like you? Exactly like me. Wait, I mean, not as good. Like me, but not as good. Why not as good? Because no one's better than me, got it? That's why I threw you off earlier, so you wouldn't get big-headed. You tried to throw me off on purpose? <sighs> I just wanted to sap your confidence a bit. You know, in the hopes that you'd abandon your dreams. Okay, true. When you put it like that, it doesn't sound great. Daniel! Don't be like that! Huh, he's angry now, but he'll get over it. Daniel Sisu, this is the twelfth book you've written criticizing Erico Platana. Why so much hatred for a former footballer no one remembers? He knows! Okay, I gotta stop all this before it goes too far. Erico Platana is a big fat meanie, and he's got a huge chin. End of prologue. Daniel, can I talk to you for a second? Hmm. <sighs> I just wanted to say... I'm sorry, I panicked, because one day, one day you'll be better than me. Forget it, Eriko. I know you don't mean that. No, it's true, I promise. Do you really think so? I know so. And you know why? Because you've got the best coach in the world, me. So we're going back to that Dunka Clown stand, and you're going to give that big clown the dunk of his life. Yoo-hoo, Daniel! Breathe deeply. Bend your knees, nice and steady. It's just you and the target. <sighs> you almost hit it. Lame! <laughs> Daniel, don't say I never do anything for ya. Winning this World Cup has officially made you the greatest footballer in history. When did you realize you had it in you to become a champ? Don't laugh, but I think it was the day I won at Dunk a Clown at my football club's annual fair. <laughs> With this new record, you've even dethroned Erico Platana. Any thoughts? I think my coach is gonna be really happy. He taught me everything I know. It's like I always say, only Coach Platana can turn a donkey into a racehorse. Yes, I did it. I'm glad you're so confident. My visions are not the most reliable, you know. What? No, I am getting my body back. 
I, I saw it! Everyone knows fortune telling is for chumps. Hmm? For chumps? <laughs> Con man! You okay, Eriko? Yeah. Just never trust bald guys who can unscrew their heads. Okay! Hey, what'd you do with your teddy bear? I left it with Steven for a ping pong match. <laughs> Nine zero? You're getting cream, Steven. <laughs> Lame! So what? So Bada Boom sees that it's getting late and that he has to go to work early tomorrow morning. <gasps> Oh, no! Bada Boom always does that just before bedtime. Heroes need their sleep, too. Have you got Mr. Tickles? Mm-hmm. Your water? Mm-hmm. Your kiss? Mm-mm. Mm -mm. Good night, sweetie. A little more? A little less? That's it. Good night, Mom. A little more? Mm -hmm. A little less? Hey, that's not nice, Eriko. Life isn't nice, Daniel. Aren't you tired of being such a baby? I am not a baby. You sleep in a onesie. They're very comfortable. How am I going to get my body back if you're still tied to your mother's apron strings? Let's talk about it tomorrow, okay, Eriko? It's Betty by time. <laughs> Sorry, Daniel, but you leave me no choice. What? Erico? What am I doing outside? What's going on? It's time for you to become a man. That's what's going on. What? And there's nothing like a little wilderness experience to make a real man out of ya. You can't leave me out here in my pajamas. Real men don't need pants. But I don't have any food. Real men hunt for food. But you're eating my cereal. And I know it's hard to believe, but it's for your own good. You can do it. It's just you and me now, Mr. Tickles. We'll have to fend for ourselves until Mom gets home. But we'll never make it without food. Seeds! Hmm. Huh? It's like cereal for birds. Good thinking, Mr. Tickles! That's what I call a manly yell. That's a spirit, Daniel! <laughs> Don't move, Mr. Tickles. Hey! Come back here, you thief! So, what's on TV? TV! What are you, hard of hearing? I said, TV! Daniel! TV! Daniel! <laughs> that kid is never around when you need him. Okay, try to look more appetizing, Mr. Tickles. That raccoon won't capture itself. Well done, Mr. Tickles. Hey, Daniel! Hmm? How do you turn on the TV? With the remote. How did you do it before? Lights, TV, toilet. Ah, so that's why. Take the bait! 
Unless... Yes! Always set multiple traps. Nice work, Mr. Tickles. Now, huh? Daniel! Food! This is Mr. Tickles, and I'm Daniel. I'm sure we'll get along just fine. I have to do everything myself around here. <laughs> Carrots? No thanks. Green beans? Yeah, right. Broccoli? Seriously? Ah, finally. Food. Daniel, what's up with this pizza? It's all cold and hard. Well, it's frozen, Erico. Oh, okay, Iron Chef. So what do I do with it? Well, put it in the oven. Ah. Uh -huh. In the bathroom? No, the kitchen. Are you sure you don't want me to help you, Erico? Ha! You help me? I'm a man, Daniel. Real men don't need help. Wow, what is that? This is Rascal, my new pal. He taught me to clean myself, to mark my territory, and now we're going hunting! It's Frozen Erico. You want me to help you, Erico? <laughs> Who needs help? I'm a man. So, the oven. Come on, Platana. You're a superstar. Nobody needs to tell you what an oven is, right? That one. Ha <laughs> ha! Easy peasy. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. What am I gonna do with you? <laughs> Oven! Oh no! Daniel! Ah! That kid is never around when you need him! Come on, Platana! Real men always manage on their own! Huh? Daniel! Daniel! Okay, all hmm? right. I can't cook or turn on a TV or a light. Don't wash my clothes. Sort my trash. No, oh, or change a tire. It's good to know how to get by on your own, but knowing how to ask for help when you need it is important as well. I am so glad that you said that, Daniel. Because you're going to need some help to clean up the living room. Hmm? Us? Us? I'm just a ball, remember? Mm -hmm. Wow! Look, Erico! Rascal came back with friends to help! We're saved! Wait, are you sure? Okay, everyone! We've got to fix everything up before Mom gets home!
There comes a time when a man must take responsibility for his actions. Or find someone else to take the fall. Eh? What? No, we can't do that to Rascal. <laughs> To think that they forced the French window open with a plastic spade. You were so brave, sweetie. Pizza and cartoons tonight, okay? Mwah. We had no choice, Daniel. Sometimes a man has to cover his tracks. I think I'd rather stay a kid a bit longer, Erico. Door! Door! You have to turn the doorknob, Erico. Rascal! <laughs> Hang in there, buddy. I'm gonna get you out of there. I've got you a great lawyer. <laughs> Daniel, have you seen my hair dryer? Oh! <laughs> hey, Erico! <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Where are you going? Oh, uh, nowhere! I'm going to, uh, to the, uh, <laughs> the dentist! <laughs> You're going with your sports bag? Hmm, that little guy is hiding something. There's my champion. I've got a little surprise for you. A ball! <laughs> and fetch. <laughs> That's my boy. All right, what do we got here? Shorts, knee pads, a cup, a helmet, a cushion. I <laughs> lost the ball. Hey, are you snooping through my stuff? What? Me? No. And you know what? I can't believe you think such a thing of me. I'm offended. Christine, oh, don't get me started about the heat. Oh, I'll call you back. Whoa, I can't believe it. <laughs> Care to tell me where you've been? I, I was. At the dentist, is that it? What? No, no, I was at football practice. Oh, yeah? You call that football? <laughs> so when were you gonna tell me, huh? How long has this been going on, Daniel? It all started back in early spring. Swings for the little kids? Who cares? Come on, let's go! I can't do it. Well then, I'll push you. Why didn't you tell me? Well, you are a bit touchy when it comes to other sports. <gasps> football! 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 Only football! Swings aren't even a sport. You're a football player. You must only play football, Daniel. But I like playing on the swings. When I'm way up high, it 
feels like I'm soaring through the clouds. I feel free! Your swinging days are over, you hear me? <laughs> Don't come back here, Daniel! This for your own good! It's not always easy to make other people accept your passion. Did I tell you about the self-portraits I make out of mold? <laughs> Wanna push? <laughs> See, Christine? It's just like I told you. Oh. I'm so disappointed, Daniel. Are you here to lecture me again? No, Daniel. I've had time to think. It's your life, after all. So you don't mind if I keep swinging? I don't see how I can stop you. Aw, thanks, Erico. Okay, champion, put me down. You're joking me. All right! <laughs> Sorry, Daniel, but pride goeth before the fall. One day, Daniel, you'll thank me for this. Wait, why are they switching places? <laughs> oh no! Swinging days are over, kiddo. <clears throat> I'm really sorry, Daniel. <laughs> that was you? <sighs> what did Maya ever do to you? How could you do that, Erico? I was only trying to protect you, Daniel. You have no idea how cruel people can be to someone who dances with ribbon. Dances with ribbon? Yeah, I, I mean big kids on swings. But no one's making fun of me. What are you talking about? Don't change what? the subject, Daniel. This is about you, not me. What? Yeah, you heard me. Hmm. Erico Platana. Ribbon. Daniel, what are you doing here? <gasps> You'll never be happy if you're ashamed of your passions, Erico. <gasps> See you after the weight room to eat some steaks. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Daniel. Huh. 
<sighs> what is he doing? I'm gonna be late for work again. <laughs> oh, here he comes! What's he waiting for? I'm already late for work. Come on, little guy. Ugh. Forget it, Daniel. It's not worth it. <laughs> you were right, Daniel. <laughs> Hang in there, buddy. I'm coming. You should never give up on your dreams. Swing it, champ! Swing! <laughs> Bravo! You're the best! Good job! Amazing! Higher! Seen nothing yet. <laughs> the playground swing was recognized as an Olympic sport in 2028. Daniel Sisu was the first athlete to win gold in this discipline. Maya's mold self portraits were exhibited all over the world. As for Eriko Platana, he continued to practice ribbon dancing until his dying day. Daniel, go on, you're almost there! What? Goal! What's he doing? Don't stop! <laughs> Did you see that, Erico? I messed up, but I played with my heart. How can you be so pleased with yourself while putting in so little effort? I don't know. It comes naturally. <laughs> That wasn't a compliment! <sighs> Do you realize how lucky you are to have me as your coach? Sorry, Erico. I'll try harder! Football! 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 Hmm? Squirrel! But... <sighs> hmm. <clears throat> hmm. That gives me an idea. <laughs> <laughs> Bend your knees. It'll be easier on your inner thighs. Speed, power, I've been watching you. You got what it takes to be a star. Hmm. Here's my card. Call me if you want to train with a real coach. Hmm? hmm? <laughs> Back to work. Can you do me a few kick-ups? Okay. Did you see that? I beat my record. Okay, see you later. I'm gonna go and coach Larry. Hmm? What? <laughs> Not now, Cedric. You're going to coach Larry? Well, since you're taking it easy, I figured I could also train someone else. Uh, wait, wait! I'll start again! I'll try harder! <gasps> <laughs> My plan is working perfectly. I've got a stitch. If you say so. Water. Up to you. Club is that way. Uh, sorry, my bad. Larry! What? That wasn't even my fault! You know what? I've had it! I'm gonna find someone else, too! A new coach! Oh, really? And who might that be? 
Um... Hey there, Daniel. <laughs> Maple! I'll ask Maple! Maple? You're replacing me with Maple? Okay, you know what? We are done. From now on, I'm going to coach Larry. Oh, yeah? Fine! 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 <laughs> Um, Maple? Daniel, these potatoes sure are giving me a hard time. Would you like to be my personal trainer? Hmm. Look at this squash, Daniel. What do you see? Uh... It's smiling? Yeah. The man looks at the squash, and the squash smiles. Take this watering can, Daniel. Whoa! I accept to guide you. Yeah! <laughs> Does your mom still make that excellent apple pie? Okay, you're in luck. Hmm? My schedule's been cleared. We can start training right away. Come on, 30 laps of the field, 100 push-ups, and 50 pull-ups. Then we start the warm-up. Um, I don't think so. Uh, what? Uh, but, but, um... Uh, uh, you don't make the rules. I'm a future star, okay? You can't replace talent. Coaches, on the other hand... Pooh. <sighs> okay, what do you want? I might have an idea or two. Um, so where does practice start? Mental preparation is key, Daniel. Oh, right. Quit worrying. You'll stress out the endives. I ordered a pony, not a donkey. Put me... Put me through... Settle down, Caramel. Put me through to your manager! Huh? Erico! Ah! ah! Daniel. I, uh... Just came to get something out of my locker. <laughs> and, uh, how's it going with Larry? Ah, great. Perfect. He's... Very receptive. And you with Maple? <laughs> Squashes have so much to teach us, Daniel. Uh, um, same. Huge mental preparation. Good luck with your donkey. It's not a donkey, okay? It's a pony and his name is Caramel! <laughs> Maple? Coaching is a real job, Dad! Oh. Hi, Daniel. I was thinking, now that we've spread out the compost and pruned the fig trees, could we work on some passing? Of course. But first, nap time. You must always listen to your biological clock. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Whoa! I'm making so much progress with you, Maple! <laughs> Oh. Right, here's your pony. You like it? Great. Ready to practice now? Hmm. All I'm seeing is a donkey with a ribbon. What I asked for is a pony. Okay, you listen here, Blondie. I'm only gonna say this once. I've never seen a... I've never seen anyone improve this fast, champ. <laughs> I'm starting to wonder what you're still doing in this club. <laughs> hmm, now that you mention it... Erico. Daniel? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Erico, I've thought it over. If you'd rather coach Larry, go ahead. But I think we should give it another shot. Uh, I just can't do it. Erico? Yeah? I... I've thought it over and... Daniel, I need to talk to you. Huh? Larry's gonna transfer to a new club and, uh... He asked me to go with him. You, uh, wanted to say something? No, nothing. 
I hope Larry becomes a great champion. Huh? Hello, I'm waiting over here. I'm not sure I should just take the number 10 jersey because although there is a one in it, like first, there's also a zero. And as for that, you know. Ah, Daniel, are you coming? It's time to read to the zucchinis. <laughs> well, somebody seems under the weather. I have, I have a friend who means a lot to me, but, but I can't seem to let him know. You can tell your friends anything, Daniel. That's what friends are for. Oh, thanks, Maple. You really are bad at coaching, but your flat peaches are to die for. They sure are delicious. <laughs> 20 minutes! <laughs> wow, Caramel! <laughs> Let's go! I've got a coach to get back! Sorry, that's me. I love the violin. Hmm. Well, time to sign the contract. If anyone is opposed to this union, speak now or forever hold your peace. No, oh, Caramel! It's the other way! The other way! You're really sure? Don't complain afterward, it'll be too late. Please, Caramel. It's really important. So lazy, Caramel. Stop! Daniel? Sisu? Don't do it! I want you to be my coach and no one else! Oopsie. Too late, Sisu. Hmm? Daniel! Never trust a man in a puffy jacket and loafers. <laughs> Monday, we're gonna start with 10 laps, some kick-up sessions, and then we're gonna work on this right foot. You got it! Uh, do you think we could keep Caramel? Nah, he's only rented. Caramel! Daniel, don't you think this trophy used to be shinier? What are you watching? Something amazing! Don't forget to subscribe and to smash that like button. Finger football! <laughs> Finger football? <laughs> That's baloney, Daniel. Nobody can do that with just his fingers. Sure you can. Look, it's easy. Wait, wait, wait. Let me try. If you can do it, anybody can. Try to go lighter on your joints, Erico. Hey, I'm the football star here, okay? You think you're better than me? <laughs> oh, no. He is better than me. No! I'm a superstar! Whoa, 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 calm down there, Mr. Big Head. What if I film you, superstar? How will you take the pressure then? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What if I post it online? Then what? <laughs> Daniel Sisu, is that you in this video, little guy? How'd you like to play for the national team? Me? Him? Our top striker broke a nail. When I saw your video, I knew I'd found his replacement. Welcome to the big leagues, Daniel. Welcome to the World Cup. Wow! The stadium is going crazy tonight! Wow! Yeah, finger football, World Cup. What a joke. Ready to meet the team? Guys, let me introduce you to the amazing prodigy I was telling you about. Uh, uh hi. I'm Daniel. Hey. Okay, team, hop, hop, hop. We're on in five. Ho! 
Hold on there, Daniel. You sure about this? Of course I am, Eriko. The team needs me. <sighs> Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. These guys are pros. You could easily mess everything up. You think? The first match is the moment of truth. If you're not up to it, it'll show. But hey, I don't want to pressure you. <laughs> goal! Daniel Sisu scores his fifth goal! What a game! Seriously? And then, the goalie didn't see that I'd taken the shot, so I thought I'd make the right move, and then... <laughs> How is he doing it? Everything okay, Erico? Perfect! Just perfect! But don't get too big-headed now. The first match is always the easiest. It is? But I thought you said... I say a lot of things, okay? You had some beginner's luck. The hard part starts now. If it all ends in tears, Daniel, don't go crying to me. Another victory for Daniel Sisu! Everything this little guy touches turns to gold. Is nothing beyond his reach? Sisu! Sisu! Who can stop Daniel Goldfinger? Seriously, that's going too far. Erico, Erico, look! I got a sponsor, nail polish. It's Robin Egg Blue. Sponsors, huh? Daniel, I pulled a few strings. You're gonna like this. I got you more sponsors. Wow, really? You know there are two things I never joke about. Business and, and plastic, plastic surgery! surgery. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> okay then, first off. Solid 32 karat gold watch. I got you the small model, 2.8 kilos. I, I think it's a little heavy, Erico. Oh, you ain't seen nothing yet. Bronze ring from the heavyweight collection, timeless. Steel claw, medieval line, the skull is cast iron. Sterling silver with a diamond finish. Because sometimes, you gotta treat yourself. Wow. The Arctic Expedition Mitten, triple thickness. That's enough, Erico. I can't play with all this on. Not without your falconer's glove and your Kevlar oven mitt, that's for sure. Stop! I already can't lift a finger. How am I going to manage on the field? Well, that's your problem now, Daniel. We're committed now. I've signed the contracts. Hmm? Hmm? Daniel, semifinal starts in 30 seconds. We're waiting on you, champ. You're not gonna throw in the towel over a little thing like this, are ya? <laughs> Goal! Daniel Sisu carries his team through to the next round after playing the entire match left-handed. Is there nothing he can't do? What is this? Captain Sisu! Captain Sisu! Yeah! And a big thank you to my sponsors. Captain Sisu! Captain Sisu! That was a close call, Erico. Good thing I can play with both hands. Yeah. Good thing. Yeah. But now's where it gets tough. We're up against the Jaguars. In the final. The Jaguars? Yeah. They're the most dangerous team in the tournament. I hear they'll stop at nothing. Stop at nothing, huh? Whoa, it's dark in here. Is anyone there? Ah, Danny, come over here. You and I should talk. Here's our offer. I think it could be good for you. If the Jaguars win the final, you'll get a year's worth of luxury hand care for delicate skin. We offer you an entire year of luxurious care for your hands at the Intensive Deluxe Beauty Spa. Whoa! Uh, no! I can't! My team is counting on me! Think it over, little guy. I wouldn't want anything bad to happen to you. Nails break so easily. Sorry, my answer is no. 
He said no. <sighs> you don't leave me any other choice, Daniel. Daniel Sisu, could you follow me, please? Care to explain this? Some hand cream with a scent of orange blossom? It was found among your things. You know it's strictly forbidden by the rules, right? No, Daniel, not you. Tell me you haven't been dabbling in that. What? No, uh, that's not mine. I would never cheat. We'll know soon enough. <laughs> I'll let you off this time, but I've got my eye on you. <sighs> Erico! Erico! Someone tampered with my stuff! Daniel, you weren't disqualified? But why are you saying that? I haven't told you anything yet. <laughs> that fragrance. <laughs> that delicate natural perfume. You smell like orange blossom! You're the one who planted that cream in my stuff so I'd be kicked off the team! Fine, I did it. But it was for your own good, Daniel. You've been impossible since you started playing here. That's not true. You're just jealous. I'm better than you at finger football, and you can't handle it. Better than me. Better than me. Better than me. Forget it, Erico. I'll play in the final without you. Who does he think he is? Just because he's captain the World Cup final. Ugh. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. Daniel Sisu's team is crushed by another goal. You could at least have got us seats for the final, Dad. Shh. Listen. Things are not looking good in this final for the reigning champion. The young prodigy seems to be out of sorts. What a sorry sight. In my 20 years on the job, I've never seen such a sad player. Oh, no. Daniel! Sisu misses another ball. He just cannot seem to keep his head in the game. Uh, what? <laughs> and a nasty tackle takes down Sisu. Is this the end of the road for Daniel Goldfinger? Get up, Daniel! Yeah. Come on, you can do it! You're the best. And I should know, because you're even better than me. It's incredible! Sisu has just gotten up! He's broken away alone towards the goal! It's the final minutes of play! He's about to shoot! Goal! World champion! Daniel Sisu goes down in history! He wins a two-year subscription to Finger Football Magazine, a gift for for some nail polish and the World Cup. What a feeling. <laughs> I'm speechless, ladies and gentlemen. That's my Daniel. See, Erico? Now we're both champions. Yeah. Well, if you ask me, there's still one of us who's a little bit more of a champion. <laughs> Cushion. Volume. Food. Voila, Erico. Bon appetit. <laughs> Daniel, can you come here for a second? Hmm? Is this tap water? Mm hmm. <sighs> it is tap water. Send it back and tell the cook that this is unacceptable. But Erico. I'm the cook. Listen, Daniel, that's not my problem. Work that out in the kitchen. That's enough, Erico! I do everything around here and all you do is complain! If you don't like my food, you can cook for yourself. You're right, Daniel. It's just that ever since I lost my body, a TV dinner is one of the last little pleasures that reminds me that I'm still human. Forget it, Daniel. I'll go get my own glass of water. If I can open the fridge, that is. No, Erico. <laughs> I'll take care of it. I lost my body. The last little pleasures. I'm still human. 
Daniel, you know I hate surprises. ta -da! But those perfect legs, that muscled torso. <laughs> what is that monster? Surprise! It's a robot. See how much it looks like you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. But where did you find it? Online. It comes from a Japanese lab. They're really good. Sugoi! But wait, there's more. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> uh, Daniel? Ta-da! You see? It's a robot that you can drive. So, are you happy? Do you like it? <laughs> I'm walking. Yeah! Woohoo! I can move, Daniel! <laughs> I've got so much to catch up on. I'll be able to frolic around the fields, jump in puddles, do a platana flip kick. Your signature move? I'm not sure the robot can do that. Platana flip kick! I still don't see how you managed to do that to yourself in the backyard. Right, I've got to go, honey. You sure you've got everything you need? Mm -hmm. Don't worry, the robot's unharmed. Talk about a lucky break, huh? You're going out, Eriko? You bet. I've been without a body for so long. Believe me, I am not going to waste a second. Okay, but I thought we were gonna hang out together. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. Do you really think I'd leave my best friend all alone with his leg in a cast? There, a baby monitor. Now you can call me if you have an emergency. Huh? But only for an emergency, okay? And then the guy shows up and he's all like, beefy, sports car, fake tanning. Ugh, insufferable. <sighs> Howdy, ladies. Can I offer you a ride? Yeah. Don't move. Daniel, this is really not a good time. I'm so close to... Yeah, okay, fine, two sacks. Erico, Erico! Not now, Daniel. But it's important. Yeah, sure, but my thing's important too. Excuse me, Erico Platana coming through. Yeah, 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 yeah. Is this the most expensive picture you've got? I'll take two for my bathroom, because actually, I... I gotta go number one! <laughs> oh. <laughs> and there, check it. When I do that, this one is working. Oh. And when I do that, this one is working. Oh. And this one, too. Oh. This one. Oh. And also this one. Oh. 149, oh. 150. Are there any heavier dumbbells? I'd like to work up a bit of a sweat. Erico? Erico? I can't get to sleep. Can you sing me the sleepy time song? Not now, Daniel. Come on, please! rock a bye baby on the treetop. When the wind blows, the cradle will rock. Come on, I said emergencies only, Daniel. Mm. Sorry, Erico. Wait, don't tell me you haven't eaten. <laughs> oh. Okay, then, one little glutton special with extra whipped cream. And hazelnut pieces. And hazelnut pieces. Don't forget the toy surprise. And the toy surprise. <laughs> toy.
Sonia? Do you know her, Eriko? Of course, she's my agent, Daniel. She can relaunch my whole career. Tanya, <laughs> it's me, your favorite client, Eriko Platana. Yeah, if you say so. What? But it's really me. Don't you recognize me? Eriko, can you ask for another surprise? Not now, Daniel. But you see, I already have this one. So I was I thinking... said not now, Daniel! Oh! Oh! The whole day's been all about you, you, you. Well, enough is enough! Oh! Sorry, Eriko. I'll get out of your hair. Eriko, so great to see you again. Oh, finally, now you recognize me. Well, you have to admit you uh, didn't hold back on the plastic surgery. <laughs> but there's only one person I know who talks to kids like that. So, I take it you're back in business? What's wrong, honey? You lose your ball? I gave it a Japanese android! And now it's going back to its career as an international footballer! Hmm? Oh, kids and their imaginations. Daniel? Yeah. You ready, champ? You're going on in five. Hmm? Hey, don't look at me like that! I'm not gonna babysit Daniel for the rest of my life. You're the one who broke his leg, not me. I guess I was a little hard on him, wasn't I? No, what am I talking about? I'm about to get my life back. That's what matters most. Ladies and gentlemen, after a long hiatus from the limelight, he's back! The greatest footballer in the world, Eriko Platana! Eriko Platana! Ah, here he is! <laughs> that bow tie doesn't suit me at all. Eriko? What are you doing here? Remote control. You were right, Daniel. Those guys are really good. Sugoi! But what about your big comeback? I think you should listen to what our friend has to say. You know, I've always relied on my instincts to achieve my goals. But recently, I learned... Gonna say. I had an entire passage on friendship and loyalty, and a great allegory with a baby monitor. <sighs> but to sum it up, I'm sorry about your leg, Daniel. I forgive you. Okay, okay, Daniel, I can't breathe. Is it ready yet? Just a sec. Voila! Sushi. Sushi. <laughs> What's with all the huffing and puffing? Maple's got some big news. Okay, hazelnuts. There's going to be some changes around here. Starting today, it's practice, practice, practice. <laughs> Daniel, am I dreaming? Or are you finally going to play football? We're gonna start with 10 laps of the field, then push-ups, pull-ups, sit-ups, dribbles, passes, penalty shootouts. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Happy birthday, Steven. <laughs> you got me. You really got me. Oh, 
Deep down, I knew it wasn't true. 52 years old? No, that's a cause for celebration. This team is killing me. Football isn't a joke. There's no game without pain. Exactly. Wait, what? Pain. Pain. I don't know where it go. I don't see anything unusual. Your friend's got a problem, Daniel. Look at her. Pain. But Tame is always like that. That's her thing. Dark and brooding. Football's a team sport. If one player's got a problem, the whole team's got a problem. Especially if it's the only good player. But... The only good one! So be a proper team captain and go talk to her. Hey, Tamea, can I sit here? Sure. What's up these days? You good? Yeah. You want some cake? Thanks. Well, nice talking to you. Later. Everything's fine, Eriko. Tamei is the same as always. Are you kidding? She barely said two words. Yeah, but that's how she is. Quiet and mysterious. So it's worse than I thought. There's nothing to worry about, Eriko. I'll prove to you that Tamei is fine. I'll go and make her laugh. <laughs> I'd pay good money to see that. Oh, no. Please don't tell me you're doing the clown. Yep, you're doing the clown. Right, Eriko. Tamea's not okay. She didn't laugh at a single one of my gags. Not even the surprise tickle attack. Pain! Pain! Maybe we need more clowns. No, Daniel, no more clowns. But, Eriko... No! More clowns! You know what makes people happy? Money. When I feel down, I just buy myself something nice and... ka I feel much better. But what would make Tamea happy? I'm telling you, money buys happiness. Just buy her something. And that works? If it doesn't work, just buy something more oh. expensive. Hmm. Tamea Morganson? Yeah. I've got a solid gold watch for you with a diamond bezel and a calfskin bracelet. Will you please sign for it? Nah. What about for the jet ski? Turbo engines and a leopard print paint job with calfskin upholstery. Nah. What about these bags of money? Start her up, Louie. We're sending it all back. My name is Sylvia, but whatever. I don't think she liked our presents, Erico. I told you to get two jet skis. Only cheap skates give one jet ski. I'll call the dealer. No, Erico. We need help. It's time to ask a responsible adult. You did the right thing coming to see me, Daniel. You see, adolescence is like a tightrope strung between you and others. It's not easy to find your balance. Everyone is finding themselves at that age. Even I went through my rocker phase. Believe me, Daniel. The best way to reach Tamea's heart is through her ears. That music is diabolical! Diabolical! Well, I guess we'll have to save Tamea by ourselves. No, Eriko, it's not just us. Pain. Well. Tamea needs us, Hazelnut. We have to cheer her up. Mm -hmm. If we want to open up a positive, honest conversation, we could just encourage her to talk about her feelings. Or we could just show her cute cat pictures. Mm -hmm. We've got to encourage her. Nothing beats a good compliment or two. Right, Junior? Right? Right? 
Yeah, or we could just give her some space. What about flowers? Everyone loves flowers. Do something nice for her! Chocolates! Call a hypnotist! Wowee! They've got so many ideas! Which one do we choose? We choose all of them. All of them? All of them! All of them? That's crazy! That would be... A, a perfect, perfect day! day. Target is getting close. Everything ready, Daniel? Daniel! You need to say over. Otherwise, I don't know if it's my turn to talk. Over. Duh. Is everything ready, Daniel? Over! Affirmative, Erico. The trajectory is locked. I've got Agents Tiger Lily, Big Daddy, Blondie, and Skinny Steve all in position. Over. <sighs> all right. She just passed the door. Good luck, everyone. Over. Roger. Okay, Tiger Lily. Compliment in. Three, two, one. Hi, Tamea. You look really good today. Thanks. You're up, Blondie. Here, Tamea, I picked you some fresh flowers. Mostly dark roses and black orchids. No, thanks. Chocolates? Not now, Big Daddy. Not now. Not now. Quick, we need to move on. Music, Skinny Steve. We've lost her. Tiger Lily, send in the cats. The cats! Pain. It's not working. Code red. I repeat, code red. It's all or nothing now. <laughs> Surprise! We've given your locker a makeover. We've changed your old paint for a tasty new varnish, raspberry colored. And since you like stickers, we've covered your locker with funny, cute ones. Okay, that's it. I'm off the team. What? But wait, we haven't done the dance routine or brought out the cookies yet. Uh, I mean, <laughs> There may be other surprises in store. I'll come back tomorrow to pick up my things. Chocolates! It'll never be the same again without Demea. Might as well stop playing football right now. Chocolates. Erico, I think we got it wrong. You bet we got it wrong! Cross-eyed cats? Seriously, what was that? Skateboarding cats. Now that's what I'm talking about. Maple was right all along. If we want to reach Tamea's heart, going through her ears is the only way. I know how to get Tamea to come back. Rock and roll. begging you. Anything but that. Huh? Okay. We just wanted to cheer you up so you wouldn't be sad anymore. I'm not sad. Why does everyone think I'm sad? We heard you shouting pain by the trash cans, under the bleachers, in the bushes. Pain is the name of my cat. He ran away. But he came back. Didn't you, Pain? <laughs> oh! Is he a Siamese? No, he's a short-haired Tonkinese. He's adorable! Uh, can you please get changed now? You're making me really uncomfortable. 
Has the concert been canceled? Imagine you are trees. Feel your roots run deep, deep down into the ground. Look, Maya, that one looks like a hippopotamus. Yeah, and that one looks like a dentist lost in deep thought. Oh, yeah, you're right. You know, I don't like you hanging out with Maya. She's weird. We're just playing. We're finding shapes in the clouds. <laughs> clouds just look like clouds. Well, like cotton, maybe. Or like cotton candy. That one's kind of like a dishwasher, right? No way. It's obviously a jet ski. Shh. Oh, well seen, Mr. Ball. See you tomorrow, hazelnuts. And don't forget, laziness is just meditation in disguise. It was nice talking to you. <laughs> oh, no. Now your nutcase girlfriend knows my secret. No one can know Erico Platana has been turned into a ball. Don't worry. If anyone knows how to keep quiet, it's Maya. Mom, Dad, Daniel's soccer ball can talk. Oh, no, I got it wrong. It's Tamea who never talks. You know that things can't talk, darling. I swear. Show them, Daniel. Yeah! <laughs> it's it's a game we made up. Hey there, pals, it's Mr. Ball. What's up? Nobody talks for real. Tell them, Daniel. Let's go, Maya. Say goodbye to your friend. Goodbye, Daniel. Hey, what's with that voice? I don't talk like that. Come on, hazelnuts. These crab apples won't transplant themselves. Mm -hmm. Maple, where's Maya? Well, her parents have pulled her out of the club. They think the hazelnuts are a bad influence on her. <gasps> and when I say the hazelnuts, I mean one person in particular. And when I say one person in particular, I mean you, Daniel. But don't take it personally. Oh no, Erico! What have I done? It's better this way. Your girlfriend is as batty as they come. <laughs> I mean, come on. The whole talking ball business, it's a bit... Uh... But you are a talking ball! I am? Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I am. We've got to get Maya back on the team. My prize from the baby beauty pageant, my vaccination records, and a reference letter from my mom. So, can Maya come back to the hazelnuts? We may have been too quick to judge you. I'm Mr. Ball! Remember me? <laughs> Why the long faces, Mr. and Mrs. Sad Sacks? Somebody stole your smiles! Stop it, Erico! This isn't me, I swear! Ha! <laughs> <laughs> See how annoying that voice is? Why did you do that? Because of you, I might never see Maya again! All the better for you, Daniel. Maya's a... Uh... You'll never be a winner if you hang around with people like her. If you don't want me to talk to Maya, then I don't want to talk to you. Yeah, go on and sulk. We'll see who gives up first. And then I told him the only way your jersey's getting soaked is if we play in the rain. <laughs> huh? It's a good one, right, Daniel? <laughs> Chocolate pistachio, your favorite, right? <laughs> oh. <laughs> I discard my doggy bone card and win again. What do you say to that, huh? Huh? Talk to me! Say something! Anything! That's it. You're upsetting me. I'm going shopping. 
<laughs> Who does he think he is? You don't ignore me, I ignore you. Wow. The little wings on the back is maybe a bit. <laughs> but then again, the sequins on the tongue. What am I thinking? I can't wear those. They're too weird. Hi, <laughs> Mr. Ball. Whoa, cool shoes. Did you get them? What? Me in those? Nah. Me? Nah. Me? I said the same thing about my frog sweater, but now it's my favorite. <laughs> I forbid you from not hanging out with Maya. She's amazing! For real? Thanks, Eriko! <laughs> whoa, 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 easy champ. We still need to win over her parents. But how are we gonna do that? We'll show them that they have their own little strangeness, too. Then they won't have any reason to stop you from seeing her. But they don't seem strange at all. Believe me, Daniel. Everyone's got a frog sweater or wing sneakers hidden away somewhere. <laughs> Trust me. I've got a plan. Hello, I'm the plumber. We didn't call a plumber. You didn't? Oh, my bad. Ha. Well, now that I'm here, let's uh, let's have a coffee. <laughs> Erico, no offense, but is that the plan? While I'm distracting the parents, you rummage through their bedroom and find their weird stuff. for weird stuff about your parents. Shh. Okay. Pretty cups you've got here. What's that? Uh, porcelain? Crazy weather out there. First it's hot, then it's cold. <laughs> How do you dress for that, huh? So anyway, you two been together for long? I'm calling the police. Nothing! There's nothing! It's no use, Daniel. My parents are really square. They even iron their socks. Are all your books instruction manuals? Yes. No way! Don't they have a secret cupboard or drawer? Hmm? Grandma's hat box! Nice decor! Is it Swedish? Yes, still here. He's wearing a fake mustache. Come quick. Okay, you got me. I have a fake mustache. I'm self-conscious about my upper lip. I didn't hear anything. You hear something? <gasps> Daniel? Too late! I know your secret. In Grandma's hat box, there is... A hat? Mother's hat. Oh. Good job, Daniel. Bravo. I couldn't find anything weird, Erico. The only painting on the wall was a painting of a wall. We tried. That can't be right. Everyone has a wacky side, a loose screw. Everyone's a bit cuckoo. <gasps> Erico, what are you doing? I know what your quirk is. It's Maya. She's your pair of winged sneakers. Oh, yeah, that's it! What you're trying to hide is Maya! I know it worries you that Maya isn't just like everybody else, but that's what makes her so great! Without Maya, life would be so much less surprising! You should be proud of her and let her be herself! I think the boy and the strange plumber are right. 
Does this mean I can go back to the hazelnuts? <laughs> that one looks like me on a yacht. Oh, and that one's me on a sailboat. And that one's a glass blower at his son's birthday party. Yeah. What? His son is a dinosaur? Oh! Wow! Look, Maya, it kind of looks like your parents paragliding on a giant cow. Hey, wait. <laughs> <laughs> ah, parents. <laughs>